Hey guys, it's Monday vlog time again. Hopefully everybody had a good weekend. Last week was a pretty busy week. As you guys saw, I got a number of videos up on the main channel. One of them was the jet stream, which was absolutely awesome. Had so much fun with that boat. And another one was the Rolarlo car. And I think there were some mixed feelings in the comments section about that car. Uh, number one, guys, I actually really liked the car. I mentioned that at the end of the video. I think it's got a lot of potential to it. I just didn't see the big deal about the arrow wing on the back that so many were making a big deal about. Uh, I don't, it didn't really work for me. I mean, after the cameras were off, I was driving the car around and, you know, I was trying the different adjustments and I just didn't feel the rear of the car hooking up. So it was a little bit gimmicky to me, but I like the car overall. I think it's pretty well built and I like the concept behind it that you could go and make it a speed run car. It does go fairly fast out of the box when you go throw a 3S pack in there. And it's pretty cool that you could go make it a dual motor car later. So that's something I wanted to clear up. I don't think everybody thought that I liked the car and, and I actually do. But anyway, I've got some more stuff that came in last week that I'm going to show you guys today. As you can see, the workbench is pretty full over here. But I actually wanted to start off talking about the Gorgon, which is the new Arma two-wheel drive monster truck. And there's something that's just tweaking me, guys. People saying that it's a copy of the Traxxas Stampede. Guys, it's not a copy. And I, I know a bunch of you that are watching this vlog know this. It's a class competitor truck. And we've been over this a bunch of times. When a manufacturer releases a car nowadays that may look like another car, it's a car to compete in the same class. Unless you could go and take parts off of that car and put it directly on the competitor, it's not a copy. It's just a class competitor. So this Stampede right here, it's designed completely different from the Armagorgon although it has a similar shape. Just means it's in the same class. So if you're seeing that stuff in the comments, maybe correct people. I mean, I guess people coming into the hobby don't know the differences in classes, so that's why they're calling it a copy. Let me know what you think about that in the comment section below. But here, here are some of the new things that I got in this week. Obviously, I got the Gorgon ready to run and the kit version which I'm going to build up. I might build a kit up here on this channel, and I've got a plan for the main channel for the two cars. Then I got some Tamiya stuff in, which is very cool. The squash fan. I know a lot of people are interested in the squash fan. And then the super saver. That is pretty awesome. And here, guys, here is the final box from those Kyosho boxes I showed you in a, a previous vlog. It's the Kyosho MP10E ready to run. Absolutely awesome looking ready to run buggy. I can't wait to go drive that up at RC Madness. A uh, little update, I still didn't get to run the fifth scales yet because it rained on the day I was planning, actually the two days I was going to run on Friday or Saturday, and it rained both of those days. So I still haven't gotten out with those trucks yet, really dying to drive those. And there's a couple of people actually upset with me because I haven't run them yet, and I'm trying my best. Obviously, I get a lot of stuff in, and I actually want to drive my stuff more than one battery pack, so I spend a lot of time with the cars. So the stuff's coming up. Got to bear with me. It's going to come. <laughs> I can't wait to do it. But yeah, those are some of the messages I get. Why haven't you reviewed it yet? So that's what's happening this week, guys. I've got a lot of stuff going on. Always a lot of stuff going on. But I don't want to just throw out videos to throw out videos. I want to make sure you guys get some value out of it. So it helps you with your RC hobby. All right. We'll see you next week for the Monday vlog.